Say hello to my little friend, the Mackenzie friend. Hello, I'm Adrian Corbold, accredited specialist in wills and estates at Turnbull Hill Alloys with the Battle of Wills series, where I talk about contested estates and wills generally. In court, a party is either legally represented by a barrister or a solicitor, or they are self-represented. That barrister or solicitor must be admitted in that jurisdiction in order for them to present to court, to address the judge, address the court, cross-examine witnesses, submissions, everything like that. If they are not an admitted legal practitioner, they may not address the court. So the other alternative is someone self-represent, meaning they conduct the case completely by themselves. Now, there is an exception to that in what is known as a Mackenzie friend. A Mackenzie friend, this expression comes from a 1970 case of a family law case where a uh, husband could no longer afford legal representation. Uh, his lawyer stood down, but the barrister said he would help out and he sat next to him and he uh, prompted him, gave him advice, recommended how he cross-examine witnesses. On the first hearing, the judge said, no, you can't have that person assist you. On appeal, the Court of Appeal said, you can have someone who is not legally representing you aid you in your court case, but it's very limited in that they cannot uh, advocate for you, but, they, but you can give little prompts, take notes, little things that don't obstruct with the hearing itself. Mackenzie friend and actually it was a, that was a British case and the Mackenzie friend is a current practicing Queen's Council in Queensland. So why am I talking about a Mackenzie friend? Having run many cases in the Supreme Court of New South Wales, I have observed it is not a friendly place to be if you do not know what you are doing. Generally a party uh, is represented by a solicitor and they have the assistance of a barrister who is advocating for them. That barrister and solicitor generally should know all the rules of the court, of which there are many. Rules of evidence, rules of procedure and practice, countless things, which takes years of experience and knowledge to assist the client. A self-represented person often is at ends with, they just cannot know all the things they need to know to run a case properly. So a Mackenzie friend can help out making notes, giving assistance, but if they're not legally trained, they may not know how to help them effectively. So you can self-represent and have someone who's not legally trained assist you, a Mackenzie friend, but the courtroom is a bit of a coliseum. It's not a forum where you wanna be if you don't know what you're doing. Hence the benefit of having proper legal representation. I hope this has been of interest. Talk again next time.